argument is just yet. So let's just put those two parentheses mm -hmm. and then the colon, okay? Mm -hmm. All right. So what is supposed to be in nine lines? It's saying that it uses the function three lines provided below to print a total of nine lines. Now, here's the thing that we need to understand, okay? This function here, let me, let me just um, zoom the screen up a bit. Um, okay. So this function here is what we're supposed to be using inside our function called nine lines, right? So, yeah, sure. this, so this will print three lines right here, okay? You see that? Yeah, this prints yeah. three lines because it's using, okay, probably what we should do first is try this out and see what it does. And then we, we, we can start the actual program, okay? So let me, let me just put a comment here and say more to come later. All right, we'll get back to that. Let's just try out the function that they gave us first and then we'll see what it does. Okay, so uh, let me go ahead and run. So my run button is over here. All right, and it's gonna be popping up a screen that you can see the results. So let's see what it does. Okay, it says there's an indented block error. Okay, let me fix that. Let me see which one of these blocks is not correct. Line, oh no. It says line six. Let me see what's on line six. Uh, what did I do wrong there? I, I just copied this from the from the um, U people website, so I don't know if it if it has any space. No, there's no space in front of it. Uh, okay, let me let me just try to retype it manually and see what happens. Um, I don't know if there's anything that I copied from. Sometimes when you copy things from websites, you get problems. You know. Let me just type it manually and then see if it works. Okay, I'll get rid of this one up here. I know it looks the same, but yeah. Uh, let me just try it again. Let me run and see what happens. Did it give me the error again? Okay, so now it says line eight, indenting error. Hmm, what is the problem here? Uh, let me see, try this again. It says new line. Okay, it's in the meeting with Ellen in 10 minutes. Okay, I may need to restart this. Uh, new line, hold on that. Yeah, I don't see, I don't see why there's, there's a problem here. Oh, what if you try to literally count the, the spaces for intendation? Okay, let me, let me, let me just, um, let me just clear everything and just um, look. Okay, so define new line and print. Let me just start from scratch here. We may need to restart because this free version of um, the Zoom will end shortly. Okay. So, um, right. yeah, it gives a 40 minute um, limit, unfortunately. All right, let me just try to run this um, and see if it executes before I do anything else. Okay. So no errors there, <laughs> strange. <laughs> okay, oh, I'm supposed to be clicking in the white space. All right, let me now retype three lines, which uses new line, okay. Three lines. Let's just check this again. Oh, three underscore lines, yeah. Is that the same? Okay, good. And then this uses the new line function. So what is actually happening here is that this function is called three lines. It's actually made up of function calls to, to new line. Does that make sense to everyone here? Yeah, it does. It's actually, yeah, it's actually calling the function from the top. So, so this function now will do the job of doing this um, function here. Um, but it's going to do it three times. Okay, let's let's just run this before the time runs out on Zoom. All right, so no errors. All right, so let's actually do a call of three lines and see what it what it does before we actually start the the the, the question. So to call the function, we 
use the function name and the brackets. And then let's run it and see what it does on the screen. OK, so it prints the three dots. OK, good. All right, so this code is fine. Now, uh, for us to make the program called, sorry, the function called nine lines, uh, it's supposed to print a total of nine lines. How many lines do we have printed here? Can anybody tell me? It's three, right? Okay. Those are three. Yeah, three. That, that's why you have those three dots there. I'm not sure if you can see my mouse cursor moving, but so we suppose we're supposed to have nine dots. Anyway, let's get straight to the point before we get kicked out. All right. So all we need to do is have this function called three times because three times three is nine. Okay. Does, does that make sense? Yeah, yeah, sure. Remember, remember this one printed one time, but we have three dots because we have new line, new line, new line three times. So here's how we go. So we're going to create, uh, let me get rid of this one now. No, okay, we can we can leave that function call on the screen. So let's create um, nine lines, okay. And what are we gonna say in the body of nine lines? What do we, what, what do you think we would say? Anybody? We would say three, three lines. Three lines, three lines. right? Mm. And we'd say it again. Hey. Hey, pardon, right. Lee. Uh, yes. You haven't written. You haven't written that new line. Oh, okay. Sorry, sorry. My my fault. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you see, oh, what's yeah. what's happening is that you're taking all of this, mm. and it's going to become a part of this. That's why we don't need to say new line because new line is what mm. we made the function from a top. Okay. Yes. So it's it's three functions, and they all take something from the other. Okay. Like like this one is the like this one is the um the 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 son the grandson this is the father and this one is the grandfather okay sure <laughs> let me let me let me just finish typing this and see if it works because uh we've got 5 minutes left on the zoom all right let's see if we get the nine lines now okay let's run uh let me make this part of the screen a little bigger um, so that you can see the output and let's run. All right, what happened? Oh, we did not, we did not uh, call the function. I keep forgetting to call the function, sorry. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just too excited with this Python thing here, right? I wouldn't see anything because we did not call the function. So we need to call nine lines. Okay, there we go. Now it should um, execute the function, okay? So let me just put a comment here. Calling nine lines. That's just a comment to help us know what's going on, okay? It doesn't do anything to the program. Okay, now we have, I think we have nine lines now, right? Let me, yeah, can we count it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, wait, one, two. Oh, we had three before, sorry. Remember we had a program that we printed three before? Um, if I clear the screen, I'm sure it will work. I'd have to, I'd have to probably start over with a script. Let me, let me copy this and uh, see if I can start a new file. Sorry, one second here. Uh, let me create another file. This is the only way I know to get a clean screen that doesn't have any previous output. <laughs> Sorry about that. Python, um, Python anywhere on dot com is still a new platform for me because I'm, I'm used to using a different software. Uh, let me call it functions part two. Dot pi. New file. Okay, great. Let me just paste in the code there. And let me get the screen up. And let me run this file. Oops. Whoa, console limit reached. Uh, okay, I'll have to delete one of my consoles. Uh, kill one of the consoles. So let me kill that here. Um, 
me kill that one. All right. And I can go back to the dashboard. Functions to that pie. Okay. And now I can run this. All right, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Wait, okay. seems to be printing 12. Oh, I put this back again. Ah, that's the reason why I, I called three lines there. I should not have called three lines. <laughs> so um, let me just see if I can just print some, print some things uh, before this to get the screen to the back. Um, print. Um, this is Friday. I just want to print something so to get the screen cleared up again. Let me do this a couple of times. So whatever comes after this we'll know is the actual output. Okay, great, let's count now. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, great. So there we have, we have nine lines. All right, so let me get rid of this. Okay, so there we have it. Um, creating a function. Remember to use your own words if you're putting in comments uh, called nine lines. All right, so let me stop.